Hello there. Forget the free stuff. This is one SNP proposal that will be very popular with the Scottish electorate. Nicola Sturgeon may be trying to pull the wool over voters' eyes with visions of freebies and an uncosted and so far unviable Scottish independence. But the SNP does have one proposal that will chime with voters. And that proposal is to place restrictions on second home ownership in tourism hotspots. I've talked before about how the Welsh view what they see as the scourge of second and holiday home ownership, and that can be equally applied to Scotland. They drive up prices and place home ownership out of the reach of local people. Seeing the wealthy, predominantly from the southeast of England, swan up north to snap up all those nice houses that they can then visit once or twice a year, or when a pandemic hits, or rent out while claiming reduced council taxes where they can, and not contributing to the local economy, is one of the main driving forces that separatists latch onto. If you're wealthy and think money talks and that's the end of it, you need to start thinking about possibly being forced to pay more for the privilege, a lot more, and those who already own them might be facing compulsory purchase or even selling at a loss when those properties can only be sold on to locals. Policies that place restrictions and costs on second home ownership are already in place in Cornwall, as well as areas of Scotland, but we could soon see a big increase as house prices continue their runaway growth. The Tories, of course, could never ever back such a policy. They would view it as anti-capitalist and anti-aspirational. For them, money and property rights are all that talks in these matters. But how can you witter on about levelling up across the UK while allowing second homes to destroy local communities? It's difficult, unresolved issues like this that drive wedges into UK unity and end up with demands for IndyRef2 and Skexit. So what's your opinion on second homes? Please like and comment below.